U.S. long-range B-2 stealth bombers launched airstrikes early Thursday morning targeting underground bunkers used by Yemen's Houthi rebels, officials said. It wasn't immediately clear what damage was done in the strikes. However, there are no previous reports of the B-2 spirit being used in the strikes targeting the Houthis, who have been attacking ships for months in the Red Sea corridor over the Israel-Hamas war in the Gaza Strip. According to Defense Secretary Lloyd Austin, strikes were carried out on five fortified underground facilities. He added that the attack was executed using B-2 bombers, sending a message to terrorists. This was a unique demonstration of the U.S. ability to target facilities that our adversaries seek to keep out of reach, no matter how deeply buried underground, hardened, or fortified, Austin stated. The Houthi group in Yemen is supported by Iran. Along with the Palestinian Hamas and Lebanese Hezbollah, the Yemeni militants are part of the so-called axis of resistance against the U.S. and the collective West. Following Israel's military operation against Hamas in October 2023, the Houthis began attacking commercial vessels associated with Western carriers in the Red Sea and the Gulf of Aden. In response, the U.S. and Israel have repeatedly struck Houthi terrorist targets in Yemen, but allies have yet to halt their attacks. The Israeli military on Wednesday released a video it claimed to show strikes on Hezbollah sites and militants in southern Lebanon. The footage also showed what the army claimed to be a Hezbollah weapon stockpile. The army said in a statement that the forces located two storage facilities in a civilian area containing a large number of weapons including shells, cornet missiles, numerous at three Sagar missiles, and over 100 mortars. 
For the past two weeks, Israel was pursuing a ground incursion into Lebanon against the Lebanese militant group of Hezbollah in southern Lebanon. Hezbollah began firing rockets into Israel on October 8 in solidarity with the Palestinian militant group Hamas, following their surprise attack on southern Israel. Almost one year of low-level fighting has turned into all-out war and displaced some 1.2 million people in Lebanon.